following is a Daily Planet Online public service announcement on the United States Center for Disease Control and Prevention safety tips brought to you by the Metropolis Department of Health. Hi there, I'm Subaru. The good people at the MDA asked me to speak to you about how to be safe and stay healthy whenever the bad illness is spreading. But since I can't get sick, I asked a good friend of mine from the Daily Planet to help me with this important message. Clark? Thanks, Superman. Hi, I'm Clark Kent, reporter for the, the Daily Planet and Daily Planet Online News. Today we want to go over some of the basic yet vital things you can do to keep yourself and your family and those you love healthy during any outbreak. Wash your hands often with soap and water for at least 20 seconds, especially after you've been in a public place or after blowing your nose, coughing, or sneezing. If soap and water are not readily available, use a hand sanitizer that can't contains at least 60% alcohol. Cover your mouth and nose with a tissue when you cough or sneeze. If none is available, use the inside of your elbow, <coughs> or as my mom calls it, your cough pocket. Avoid touching your eyes, nose, or mouth with unwashed hands. This can make you sick. The best way to prevent illnesses is to avoid being exposed to them at all. So the CDC and the government advises people to avoid large gatherings of 10 people or more and avoid close contact with people who are sick. There's no need to panic, just like my friend Batman says. Don't be scared, just be prepared. If you get sick in any way, you should wear a face mask to prevent spreading it to others. Especially when sharing a room with you or going to the doctor's office. If you are sick, stay home and avoid contact with other people. Contact your doctor or other health professional immediately for advice or information. Be sure to clean and disinfect surfaces such as doorknobs, light switches, countertops, desks, and anything else that is touched frequently. And whatever you do, don't drink bleach. It won't stop the illness. It only stop you. Don't be dumb. Remember to stay calm and don't panic. If you need to go to the store for food or supplies, be cautious and courteous. Don't buy everything off the shelf. Stores will keep restocking, so please get what you need, but save some for others. That's right, this isn't a hurricane, blizzard, or some other apocalyptic crisis, or in the walking dead. You don't need to hoard supplies, like toilet paper. Come on, do you really need a hundred rolls? I mean, when I take my super poo, even I don't need that much. Now is the time for patience and calm. We're all in this together, so follow these easy steps and we'll make it through just fine. Right, Superman? That's right. If everyone does their part, we'll beat this illness and get back to normal as soon as possible. Thank you, Clark, for your help today. My pleasure, Superman. For more information, you can go to cdc.gov. There you'll find a lot of information on any other topic related to illness and disease. Thank you for watching, and please take care. Bye!